Today, family and friends remembered Zach Monday on what would have been his 16th birthday. Monday, a 15-year-old Gibbs student died back in May. Reporter Gabrielle Hayes shows us how the community celebrated his life, his memory, and his legacy. Happy birthday to you. Uh, we're here to celebrate the life of my brother. It's his 16th birthday today. Christian Monday says his brother was the kind of person who left a mark everywhere he went. He was an amazing person, an amazing brother. And today, those who love him left a special kind of mark they hope will make it back to him. On the balloon, you can write a little message on there for Zach. When everybody's ready, we all send it up at once, see if little Zach will get to read them in heaven. Today brought them closer to a friend they weren't ready to part with. A lot of people didn't get to like say goodbye. But it also meant they could remember just how special he was. As that's really what he did is just make people happy. Monday's legacy is something his brother says is permanently etched into the hearts of so many people. And if you asked who he was, they tell you something like this. A kid who he will always be nice to you. He will always be a friend to you. Zach was a people person. He loved like, making people laugh. The kid who always bring a smile on everybody's face. As difficult as the day was, his friends say they were glad to all be in one place. We just want to show our love and affection towards Zach. Loving someone who loved everyone. You know, I didn't realize how much, uh, how many friends Zach had, how much that people loved and cared about him. And after each message made its way onto a balloon, the balloons made their way into the clouds. In spirit, I know that he's like up there and he's like, this is my birthday party. Messages of love and care on a special day. Um, just to tell him how much I love and miss him. Um, know that his his brother will never forget him. And uh, I, I ho hope to see him again in the future. The Knox County Sheriff's Department is still investigating the circumstances of Monday's death.